joining me on another She Will Emulate video. So I'm not going to make this video as long or longer than it needs to be because today is one of them. So I know you're probably like, oh my gosh, it's the vlog fast. Well, I live in Florida and Morphe has just been added. Uh, so like pretty much I live in the Tampa area because Morphe has been added to one of the malls here. So I pretty much went to Morphe and I spent, well, my wife spent, this was my Christmas present. Um, my wife spent 200 or no, $460. I said two, I tried to like downplay it. Like there was no downplaying this, okay? The woman that was checking me out was probably like, her wife just did what? Yeah, literally. So, um, uh, yeah, I'm pretty much going to be unbagging everything that I got and not to mention I do actually have an order from Morphe on its way. I pretty much bought all their lip liners, so I didn't need to buy them today. Um, if you have not tried a Morphe lip liner, this is what they look like. They're amazing, awesome, and they are super buttery, super pigmented, amazing. This one right here is clean. It's actually a little mine. No, actually, it's not. Bite me is what I want. But, um, pretty much I bought like all of these so the rest of these so they have like 30 of them they're three dollars a piece so awesome sauce but other than that I'm gonna stop talking I'm just gonna get into the video I have some things in here that are kind of controversial to have together but I don't care I'm one of those people I just Alright, so I think I'm going to start with the bigger things first. Let me just take everything out. Okay, so I'm going to start everything. Okay, I'm going to do it like this. So I think I'm going to start um, by brand because if anyone knows, Morphe does carry other brands. Um more so people that they work with so one being so is Jeffree Star so I went and I copped things that I've always been wanting to have okay and two lippies that I have that actually got stolen from me so yeah all right but to start with the biggest we have the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Alien Palette. This palette is so cute, the design of it. My wife thought it was cute too, so. Oh my God, it's so, I can't even, I don't even know how to like, you can see the light in there. <laughs> I don't even know how to react to this because it's just huge. And then it has all these colors. This one right here speaks to me and this one and this one. And if anyone does not know how Jeffree Star rolls, that is how Jeffree Star rolls. Okay. You can. Oh, no, it's so horrible. Look at it. Look at it. But yeah. So that is the Alien palette. Just recently came out. So that is amazing. Uh, let me see. I can tell you a price for it. Wow, they don't even put the... Nope, I cannot tell you. Oh, it was $52. So. And then next up... Ooh. The next palette that I copped from Jeffree Star is the... Th Thirsty palette. Because Chanel did the Thirsty. like breakfast at Tiffany's in a shower. Oh, oh, oh. There it goes. But this is the Thirsty Palette. It looks like someone already put their finger on my palette. Right there. Marky, what's going on? But it's okay. It's okay. 
This Thirsty palette is super highly pigmented, just like the Alien palette. So we're just gonna get that quenched right there. Look at it, look at it, Thirsty palette. You can also buy Jeffree Star cosmetics on Lucky.com. They have this thing, Jeffree Star cosmetics product. But that is all the palettes that I got from Jeffree Star, because can't say I didn't get one more. Um, and then next up I got one of the big highlighters that he has. I didn't get any new one. I got like an old one, but it's an oldie buddy goodie. And I, ever since I first seen him, I wanted him and that is King Tut. I'm just going to go like this real quick and honey. Honey, look at it. Blinding. Blinding. Okay? Like, Jeffree Star knows what he's doing when it comes to this right here. So, that is one of the highlighters. That is, like, the last of, like, the big, like, compact things that I got from him. Um, and then next up, I got one of his lip scrubs. It is in Spearmint. Um, apparently they're, like, these are you don't know they're extremely yummy edible vegan and cruelty free so hit a lot of his products are vegan cruelty free kiss proof no I'm wrong I don't know but but pretty much it's this his packaging is so cute and pink it is probably the only thing in my makeup room that is so pink <laughs> it stands out um, but this is in spearmint so ooh. to use this later okay i gotta speed it up because i'm not trying to like be all extra y'all have seen this shit before let's just be real but if you are in the tampa bay area seriously get your ass down to morphe because there are certain things i know that you can never get online that you know what i mean like you always or is anyone those people that like has always has like cash but doesn't have money on their card and is just way too lazy to go put the cash on their card because I'm that person I am totally that person like I rather go somewhere paid in cash and just be over and done with it like that but no it's not always like that so if you are in the Tampa Bay area literally get your ass down to Morphe and I point this way it looks like I'm pointing towards it but <laughs> um literally get your ass down to Murphy liter and uh buy some shit because they have Jeffree Star there and they also have like Marilyn Wood and like all of them like just ugh. okay so next up for Jeffree Star what I have is I'm gonna pick all of them out of the packaging first I got five lips from Jeffree Star. They are current shades. I didn't get any of the new ones because his new ones have glitter in them and I love glitter, don't get me wrong. Who does not fucking love glitter? But I just draw it like a line, like a point where I just can't do too, too much glitter because I already love to like glow on my face. I just feel like, I feel like a, a Christmas tree and there's nothing wrong with being a Christmas tree. The first fun and loving colors that I got were Dirty Money and Breakfast at Tiffany's. Again, his packaging is so cute. Look at it. So, swatch them real quick if anyone has not seen it. They can be used as eyeliner, eyeshadow, anything in the book. Oh my god, that Breakfast at Tiffany's is ridiculous. I'm like so excited to, like my wife thought this one was bomb. Dirty Money has to like literally be my favorite. I love olive green. I told somebody that after I had purple hair, I might do like an olive green color in my hair and then they just look at me like, what? And I was like, yeah. But then again, I think about it and I'm like, oh, looks like dirty hair. Um, and then next up, the colors that I got were Androgyny, 
Unicorn Blood and Leo. So I've had Androgyny and Unicorn Blood before. They were a Christmas present, but someone stole them. So stole them, um, which was very heartbreaking because for anyone that does not know, I think that Unicorn Blood is like that perfect red shade. But that is literally all I got in the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Island. So again, dirty money just flying everywhere. <laughs> but literally, this is all I got. And just get your ass to Morphe. And I'm pretty sure discount codes work at checkout. I'm not sure, I did not try. Bad me, literally bad me. But I don't have a discount code, obviously. But we all know and love have our gurus out there. But I'm pretty sure discount codes work at checkout, so try one. Okay. Um, next up, I got something from one other brand. And again, it is probably the worst thing. So controversial for me to show this palette right after I just showed. Well, you're damned if you do, you're damned if you don't, and if it ruins my fucking career, oh fucking well. I'm just showing you what I got. <laughs> okay, so next, the next palette that I, god damn it, it's like not coming out. And I'm about to rip the thing around it. Jesus Christ, Lord Savior. Okay. The next palette that I got was the Manny MUA Life is a Drag palette. So again, everyone loves this palette. It's it's pretty, the design on the front, the holographic. Um, and then, um, I feel so bad for this. <laughs> um, but yeah, the shades inside are pretty. The packaging is amazing. It comes with a little makeup brush. I didn't even know that it came with that. And these shades are amazing. Like, I don't have as many palettes with like, like out there shades. So I'm trying to get more. That's why like I mainly got the Jeffree Star palettes. But um, this one is there and I used to be such a big fan, still I am, big fan of him and Jeffree Star alike, but just look at this palette. It's... Huh? Did you? Oh, hello. You can use that as a highlight. Jesus. But yeah. That is the last palette that I got. So again, Morphe at the International Mall here in Tampa Bay area ha has them. So, but they do not have the James Charles palette. I know probably people were like, oh, she's gonna, she's gonna pull out the James Charles. No, I have been looking for the James Charles palette everywhere. I cannot find it. Sold out nationwide, James, James Charles himself even said it that it sold out it's sister sold out literally so it sister sucks but i'm gonna get that palette it's literally the hardest palette that i've ever tried to get like so hard okay all right but moving on so next starting again from biggest everything else from now on that i got is strictly from Morphe. Um, it's mostly brushes, so I'll try not to bore you too much. Okay, so first I got this. This is a Morphe big, like, I think it's like, a, it's the jumbo carrying kit. Literally is amazing. It's like 20 bucks. It's so cute, like, it's the size of my head. You can fit whatever in there. Let's get that out there. But you can fit whatever in there. And literally you can have your eyeshadow brushes, your face brushes, you can take it on the go to travel. It's amazing. Alright, ow. Okay. 
And then next up, I stocked up on Morphe Continuous Spray. I put this in my last video. No, I have not ran out of the last Morphe spray. I just stocked up just in case. Better safe than sorry. If I run out of the Urban Decay All Nighter, I'll be like, I got this. So, alrighty. And then next up, I'll go from like brands that I brought, like not brand, but like collab collection or collection. Because you know how they have the Y collection, the Elite collection, the M collection, the Rose Gold collection. So, yeah. So, I do not have any, like, I have some brushes from the Rose Gold collection, so I wasn't really too worried about getting anything from there. But I have nothing from the Y collection. And so, I think I bought two of the same brushes. No, I didn't. Yes, I did. Whatever. Let me see. Yeah. So, I got two um pointed shading brushes these are the y19s you can never have enough shading brushes let's just be honest here for all those lovely transitions and to shade into shade always have to have good shading brushes so i got two y19s and then i got a a smaller shading brush um, so Y18, so cute, so cute. Love how it's gold. My wife thought it was pretty cool too. Um, I know she's supposed to be in a video with me, and she was already already supposed, we were already supposed to like film that, but things happen. So she, next one, next video, she'll be in there. And then uh, this is like a tapered blending brush, and this is a Y14. blending on my under eyes get you one or no I'll probably use this this is the Y9 to blend out my under eye it's like a like a pointed tool no it's not a pointed tool it's like it's like this it's probably a pointed tool it's like a fluffy short shader brush and then this should probably take them out of the packaging This packaging is, or not this packaging, it's not even a packaging, it's like a, I don't know. It's cute. It's gold. And in this family, we love gold, even though my wedding ring is rose gold. But, see, this is like a blending brush I'd probably use for under my eye. And then this one is a, probably use this for my blush. So it's a Y5. So this is a. like my normal like I have 110 of these <laughs> not 110 literally but let's see see I have it pretty much the same thing of it in the rose gold I have another one in the M collection too but it's the master collection um so that is brushes that I got from the Y collection, which is like the yellow, I guess they, it is, Y, Y. So cute. And I got only one brush from the Elite, so this is a E52 Premium Tapered Brush. And I got this only because I need more like face brushes. I don't really have many of them and it feels so soft. I like how it, like, instead of going like a regular, it's pointed at the end. So the Elite Collection is probably the cutest. And I need like all of them. I should have bought more, but <laughs> it's okay. I spent more than I needed to. So cute. I'm playing with it because it's so soft. Okay, all right. So I only got one brush from the Elite, and then everything else is from like the M. It's from the Master Set Collection. They're not even collections, they're sets. Or I guess you could call them collection sets. Okay, so this 
is a M50, M581. So it's a pointed tapered brush. It's kind of like the, it's like, it's a tapered uh, blending brush or something like that. It, I got it again for something to use to like put on contour, to blend from underneath my eyes. Very good for that. All right, moving on. <laughs> and then next I got a